In the University Center game room, next to Veteran Services, you'll find the Perch Studio. Despite having such a small space, big waves are being made by the Perch. Haley Solomon, the faculty advisor of the Perch, with the help of her dedicated students, such as Perch station manager Faye Arigai, have rebranded and rebuilt UTC's student radio station after COVID-19 pressed the pause button for this student organization in March of 2020. So when I first was hired as faculty advisor, um, <laughs> the Perch was essentially a non-functioning entity, so the programming was being care of by the station manager for WUTC. So music was playing, but uh, that's about it. Um, we did not have a functioning studio. We did not have a student body. Uh, we did not have student staff. We did not have um, a brand, logo, graphics, website. I mean, these things existed, but they, they hadn't been maintained for so long that um, it really felt like we needed to completely start over. When we first came to the actual studio, it was pretty in disarray. Um, not really anything hung up on the walls, and it just seemed like it had been abandoned. Um, so it was pretty much inactive at that point. Haley and her handful of dedicated Perch members assessed the situation and began making lists of what they wanted and needed to accomplish in order to rebuild. And then they went to work. They created a new brand and identity for the Perch. So they have a really fun, funky logo and the website is really cute and bright and colorful. Um, so I think they created a visual identity that is eye-catching and interesting and thought-provoking. Um, but the, in a more complex way, I mean, we have a functioning student organization now. Now, with nine staff members and about 20 hosts, the Perch is soaring to new heights. On October 27th, they held their first event and it was a big win for the team. The Perch Launch Party Spooktacular is the official name. It was a show that had three bands, two DJs, and we had tables set up at UTC's amphitheater, and we were kind of just celebrating the launch of The Perch and finally being able to get up on our feet and get started. It was a total success. I was really proud of the students' efforts and um, how they executed the event. With the first successful event under their belt, the Perchlings are hungry for bigger and better events and are aiming to be more widely known among the student body and UTC campus community. So we have three pillars of of growth or goals that we are trying to achieve. The first is brand awareness. So we want to be able to be anywhere on campus and say the perch and not have to immediately say what it is. So every time we seem to talk about it with students, we immediately get the follow-up question of what is the perch? Um, I've never heard of this. <laughs> uh, and so we're really trying to work on brand awareness. Then outside of that is uh, engagement. So engagement with the student body, engagement with the Chattanooga community. And this could be in a variety of ways, either having more students produce programs for the Perch or um, throwing more events that people can attend uh, that are you know, is executed by the Perch and represents the UTC community and the Perch radio station. And then having a business development where we become essentially a functioning radio station by having paid advertisement. So we're hoping to get into that, be able to sponsor ourselves from year to year with the money we make in advertisements so that, um, you know, one of my long-term goals is to take all of the student staff to public radio conferences. And um, there are specific conferences for college radio stations too. So I want them to be able to not only learn more skills in their this line of professional work, but also to make friends um, across the country with people like them who care about radio or music or subjects they love to talk about. And that's something that we need money for. So once we can get our uh, you know, functioning business plan style thing going and, and make money from advertisement, we can start to hit those big projects like taking students to conferences and redesigning our studio so it has top of the line equipment and so they can have an experience that really reflects working in the radio industry. To stream their shows, learn more about who they are and what they do, or to get involved, check out their website at utcperch.com and follow them on Instagram at theperchutc.